Meal Time Monday coming at you. What's up, Fit Crew? Here we are, back in the Fit Kitch, and uh, we got, I guess I'm going to serious talk to you about right now. It's called meal prep, okay? And uh, it's a very serious co uh, conversation we need to have about prepping your food. Check this clock out. That's 9.21 p.m. P.m. Uh, you can't eat after 6 p.m. It's terrible for you. You gain weight, you'd be fat. Not true. Uh, I'm about to eat right now, and uh, it's 9.21, and uh, <clears throat> I'm not fat. So, that's the issue. Don't believe all that crap. It's what you eat after 6 p.m., 7 p.m., whatever, 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 okay? Obviously, um, if you're not being active, you don't need to eat all those uh, complex carbohydrates or carbs, period, because you're going to bed, but you do need to feel your body, you need to feel your muscles, you need to feel your, your, uh, your, just your system in general so your body can produce and be efficient at burning calories while you sleep and uh, repair your body, especially after working out. So that's what we got going on. So the first topic of conversation is what are we eating right now, okay? So I have two dishes here, obviously one for myself and one for Faith. Um, it's a salad-ish, and uh, what we're going to do is we're going to add a burger to it. You guys know I love burgers, and uh, there's nothing better than to add a burger to your salad. You know, this is basically a burger without the bun, okay? Boom. There's one. Faith wants hers on the side. There's hers on the side. Okay, now, what else are we going to do? Well, a, a good salad should have asparagus, right? Asparagus is kind of boring. Except when you wrap bacon around it. Okay, so we got bacon wrapped asparagus. Um, fellas, check this out. Let's have a serious conversation with the boys real quick. Boys, if you want to impress your lady and you want to have, you know, a really good time, then you need to make her bacon wrapped asparagus. The perfect way to anybody's heart is bacon. And then when you make it look pretty, then, you know, the, your, your woman is going to be all over you. Okay, trust me. Um, I don't know from experience yet, but hopefully I do. Wrap the, wrap the asparagus in bacon, okay? Then, wrap it up, put it on the grill, bam. Wait till the asparagus gets, gets a little bit soft, make sure the bacon is cooked all the way through, and you're just gonna lay it like that, so pretty, okay? Got my asparagus right between two big beef patties, doesn't get better than that. Faith gets one right there, boom. Okay, dinner for tonight is out of the way. Dinner served. And we're gonna put a little bit of this, uh, this tesemase, as you guys know, I love some tesemase just because of how natural it is and there's no, no garbage or crap on it. Um, we're going to use this zesty ranch to, uh, to put over the salad. That's dinner. Guess what? I also have leftovers, which means I have lunch. Okay? Or, while I was preparing these on the grill, I have some fish. This is some um, Dover, I believe. And uh, what we did is we just took a little bit of this Persian lime olive oil, a little bit of onions, a little bit of lemon pepper on, on the fish, a little bit of actual lemons, squeeze it on top, made this wonderful melody of flavors on that fish. It's a great white fish, so it's not really strong flavor. Um, it's going to take the flavors of what you, what you put into it and, uh, you know, put it in some foil. Don't seal it so tight, you want some air to go in there, but you want it to kind of boil a little bit while it's on the grill. And that's exactly what happened. Same thing on this one. So I got, I got lunch and possibly dinner for tomorrow. It depends on how I space myself out. But I did this in a matter of 30 to 40 minutes, and I got plenty of food, as you can see, for a couple meals, where one, I don't have to go out to eat. Two, I'm not trying to like figure out what to eat because I don't have anything to eat. I got it all right here. So you got your fish. You know, this is this is a couple meal time Mondays in one. This is a beautiful thing. Okay, this takes five minutes to prepare. Takes ten to fifteen minutes on the grill. Boom, done. This right here just gets some spinach, some um, cucumbers, some baby tomatoes, a little bit of uh, uh, regular romaine lettuce if you want, or you can use kale or whatever you want to use for your greens. Throw it on a plate. Put a burger on top. Use some cheese if you want to. I use some um, what was it pepper pepper jack and, and salsa cheese, whatever it is, I'm not really sure what, remember what it was, but it was some kind of nice cheese that I liked, and uh, we threw it on top of there with a little bit of dressing. So, a lot of information, you may have to watch this a few times, and um, if, you, if you need to pause it and take some notes, that's excellent too, and uh, we'll see you in the gym this week. Have a great night, Fit Kitch.